Hey there guys, uh, Dr. Dual Sport here. Uh, if you look behind me here, you see big old Mount Nebo there. It's about close to 12,000 foot. Got Chris here with me today. He's on the uh, frame to Minnesota 2.0 and we got the uh, Luna Bafang uh, 1000 watt motor kit on there. And I'm on the old trusty CRF 230. Uh, we're going to test these out against each other today in the See which one we like uh, better in the snow. There's uh, probably a couple of foot of snow on this packed on this road here, so we'll see how it goes. Hang with us here, and we'll uh, tell you what we think at the end. Look at Chris, he's all smiles and uh, he beat he beat me here by several minutes. Uh, I think we've decided which is the best on the uh, snowpack. And that's the fat bike. The uh, little CRF 230, she does pretty good on ice and stuff, but it's uh, she's got the studded tires, but it's just too much weight uh, for this snow. So I guess we'll have to uh, I think unanimously vote on the uh, the Minnesota fat bike for today. Okay, guys, we tried out the fat bike. We tried out the old CRF 230 Honda, and actually, the fat bike was quite a bit of fun. The uh, the Honda, Chris said it wasn't really any fun at all. <laughs> it's just too heavy. And the snow's too soft. We're too late in the day. See where we were uh, kind of digging in there. So, we're going to do the skis and the snowshoes. Chris is on the skis today. I'm going to try the snowshoes. We're going to go to the Ponderosa and we're going to have lunch. Oh, like that. Just do a little kind of like that. Just, you, you, you plant, see, you, you go like this, you plant your foot, and then it won't slip. See, and then you push off. Kind of like this. Just to glide. So. Yeah, just just try it so that. And, and then you just do a rhythm, see, so that you're you just you just scissoring back and forth. You just alter alternate uh, putting weight on the ski and then removing weight. Yeah, you'll, 
you'll have it all figured out by the time you get there. Well guys, we've made it to the Ponderosa campground. Ponderosa. We're going to uh, head on in this way. I think we'll head down this way. I see a picnic table there right ahead. Looks like a good sunny spot. So I think we'll go there and have some lunch. That looks pretty good there, doesn't it? That table looks pretty good there. Okay, let's see, I gotta wait four more minutes and my main entree will be ready. Uh, today I, I have the uh, patriotic cookies, cheese spread, kind of windy there for a minute, uh, Italian bread sticks, uh, cinnamon bun, and my main entree is chicken pesto pasta. I'm looking forward to that. What did what did you have, Chris? I have Southwest style beef and black beans, and I already got that made. I have spiced apple slices, chipotle tortillas, and cheese spread. So maybe some quesadillas. I have some turkey nuggets, and like jerky, and I have. Chocolate chip toaster pastry. Wow, what a treat! Yeah, I figured I better give uh, Chris the black beans because uh, he spent two years uh, living in Guatemala City eating black beans, so I knew that would uh, be all right with him. So, mm -hmm. looks pretty tasty. What did you think about the skis um, Com compared to that's your first time I know on cross countries compared to snowshoes? What do you think? I thought it was harder. It was harder than technique wise, you mean? Or, or yeah, uh, probably. I just don't know the technique yet. Yeah. yeah. I think probably you do it one more time and just relax. It, myself, I find it easier than the snowshoeing. Mm -hmm. So, anyway, we're glad we could try those things. We actually we like the fat tire bike better than the old Honda. Didn't you? Mm -hmm. It was actually, you could actually go pretty good. Yeah, it was light but enough. If our snow would have been uh, more crisp, Earlier in the day, uh, I think you could go no problem, basically, don't you? Mm -hmm. yeah. All right, that's our story. We're going to enjoy our lunch and then check out for the day. So thanks for riding along today. Please like, uh, subscribe, comment, share this video if you wish. This is Dr. Dual Sport out.
How was it? It's good. You were hauling butt, man. Yeah, it's going about 25 miles yeah. per hour. That's a good speed. Yeah, it's good. Fun, huh? Yeah, it all was. Right. It was all fine. Um, there were some spots where it was the snow was melting a little bit, and so it flicked water up in my face. But, yeah. And I felt a little bit of instability then, but other than that, when it was just on the ice that was frozen and on the snow, it was fine. Super traction and lots of fun.